In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to fix sign-in issues on Xbox Cloud Gaming. So I noticed that some people on my How To Get X Cloud on iOS video were having trouble signing in. Some of you mentioned that after signing in, it still showed the sign-in prompt, brought you back to the home screen, or even just displayed the download button after you've signed in. This video will show you how to fix all of those issues with just a few simple steps. So the first thing you can do is make sure that your software is up to date. Check for any software updates and install them. If you already have the most up to date software, just restart your phone once since a restart can fix issues like these. The next thing you can do is clear your Safari history and disable any extensions that you have. Some extensions can mess up the sign in process. So make sure you remove all of them or disable them. To do this, go into your settings app scroll down until you find safari and click on it and then you're just going to keep scrolling down until you see clear history and website data you're going to click on it and then you're just going to click this red button here so if you want to disable any extensions you're just going to scroll up until you see extensions right over here and then you're just going to start disabling all of these and make sure that where it says allow these extensions that it says off and just make sure that all of them are off if you're still facing sign-in issues, it's worth trying a different device. Sometimes the problem can be specific to the device that you're using. Switching to another device, such as a different smartphone or even tablet, can help you identify if the issue is device-related or not. Deleting and re-adding the cloud gaming bookmark on your device can also resolve any sign-in problems. Simply long press the icon, click delete bookmark, click delete, then go into Safari and I'm just going to leave the link for this below, but you're just going to click on any one of the games and then you're just going to click on this button at the bottom right here. You're going to scroll down until you see add to home screen, click add right over here and then just click on the app. So the reason we do this is because this refreshes the connection and can potentially fix any issues. So just hop back into xCloud and try to sign in again and see if it works. One of the main fixes to this issue is using a VPN. I've seen many people online say that this issue was fixed because they used a VPN. So what you can do is you can just simply download any free VPN on the app store, run into a server near you, and then try to sign in and see if that works for you. If I do find any free VPNs that I think are good, I will leave them in the description down below. You should also make sure that the country you are playing in is supported. I will be leaving a link in the description for this website right here where you can see which countries support Xbox Cloud Gaming currently. You can scroll down right over here and just swipe swipe right until you see Xbox Cloud Gaming. If you keep going here, Xbox Cloud Gaming, you're going to scroll down, look for the server or the country that you're in and see if it has a check mark next to it. If your country does not have a check mark, then you will need to run xCloud with a VPN. You will also need to change the location of your account or even make a new account in a location that is supported by Xbox Cloud Gaming. So as you can see, the country that I'm in, which is Canada, is supported by both Cloud Gaming Game Pass Ultimate and Cloud Gaming Fortnite. So that means that I should not have any issues running it based on my server. Anyways, I hope this video did help. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.